been at the bottom your whole life, man. And it's just always people just keep putting you at the bottom. Sometimes long women, you know what I'm saying? Just one day you just gonna be like, it's a must you see top, like. I ain't even fed a trip. I ain't worried about a hoe or a bitch She open up her mouth, I'm looking at her lip I unzip, then I tell her To suck the dick To suck the dick To suck the dick To suck the dick Hey, To suck the dick Suck the dick Told your bitch she could lick my stick Put my dick up on her face You could call it lipstick And then I take her down to my basement And when she do that shit Then she gon' suck that Like a fucking straw Your girlfriend just a hoe Take off that bra I need some topless toppies When she top me She like a mop bitch You know you gotta slot me And if you get the fucking dream That'll top me That's all I'm thinking about bitch 24-7 That's 13 Boppity boop. Huh, that shit funny. Oh yeah. I got bippity boppity boop from two and a half men. The uh the episode where uh Alan had went crazy because he was trying to beat uh Charlie. He was wearing Charlie's clothes and talking like Charlie and all that type of stuff. And um he had came back from um the psych ward because he went crazy or whatever. And uh Alan I mean not Alan and, uh Walden and uh Lindsay, they were trying to uh, break it down to him that they had a affair or whatever. You know how that crap go. And uh, he was telling them, he was like, she started crying and bippity boppity boop, we're having sex. Hey, now that shit funny as hell. So, but uh, real talk, today's video I want to talk about Satan does not care about your walk with God. Now, listen, let me break something down. First things first, Satan is not a person, okay? God is not a person. You see what I'm saying? These are spirits. We live in a spiritual world. Everything, the physical world. When we when we awake in the spiritual world, how in the spiritual world how I'm awake right now. Listen, let me explain this. When we are awake, how I'm awake right now in the physical world, the spiritual world is the shadow world. You see what I'm saying? So everything around us is spiritual, no matter what you think or no matter what you believe. Now, when we sleep and we are in the spiritual world, the physical world becomes the shadow world. Real talk. Because we are spiritual beings having a human experience, not the other way around. Now listen, the only reason why I use this, the only reason why I still use the terminology God and black and stuff like that, first things first, I know what these words mean. I'm using these words because one, when you're trying to give a message to reach people, when 85% of the people, the masses, are still stuck in that terminology, you have to speak their language. Being bilingual on a spiritual level, you have to speak their language to reach them. And then once you reach them, you can give them the real terminology, the Moors, you know what I'm saying? The Israelites, you know what I'm saying? We can get deeper than that, you know what I'm saying? The Lamorians, like, we get way deeper than that. But people, you, come on. You tell an average person, the, we Lamorians, why fuckers gonna look at you like, what? You see what I'm saying? So you have to see a black uh, God. But like I say, God is whatever you believe, because everybody believes in different things. But the entity they still believe in that they call God represents the light. You see what I'm saying? Like Buddha. You tell a Christian person that they gon' Buddha, that stuff not real. Just because you don't believe it ain't real don't mean it ain't real. You see what I'm saying? But Buddha still represents the light. You, you get what I'm saying? Jah Allah, whatever you believe in, it's an entity that still represents the light. You know what I'm saying? Just like with the Satanist people. They call their God Satan, Lucifer, the devil, whatever else fucking name they got for these ugly bastards. But you get what I'm saying? I just had to let that be known. Like, I know what the fuck I'm doing. You see what I'm saying? Like Chief Keith said, give me room, nigga. I, I can fool, nigga. Uh, real talk, though. Uh, Satan does not give a fuck about your walk with God. Real talk, and let me break this down for you. Listen, like, a lot of people may be doing evangelism. You know what I'm saying? Going around preaching the word of God universe whatever you want to call it you know what i'm saying just using that term and they might be going around but they have to know that you can't just get this information to anybody because everybody can't take this information you see what i'm saying people will try to attack you people don't know that like i say god's people have a spiritual revolution and saves people have a spiritual revolution saves people their spiritual revolution is to make sure god's people do not find themselves and make sure they don't wake up so they're gonna try to attack they're gonna try to do whatever they can you see what i'm saying so it's like you can't be like just speaking this to anybody. You see what I'm saying? 
Because saints, people don't give a fuck about your walk with God. Like, for example, let's say if you're a person who's just now finding my videos or you find a, another person's videos that's dropping the message. If you're not spiritual or if you're not built for this type of stuff, don't even seek spirituality. You know what I'm saying? Because you're just going to hurt yourself. You're only going to get hurt because you are pretty much, you know what I'm saying, walking on this journey and you don't know what the fuck you're doing. You get what I'm saying? Like, it's a lot of people that try to walk this spiritual journey, and they don't know what the fuck they're doing. And they just try to, you know what I'm saying? They think they know what's going on, but they really don't know. You see what I'm saying? Like, when it comes to spirituality, it comes a time where you're the student and you're learning. And then as you continue to learn, then you start to be the teacher. But you always constantly learning. You see what I'm saying? Because at one point in time, I was just lost like a motherfucker. Then I start coming across spirituality. I start soaking in the information. And I start taking notes and learning. Learning, earning your L. You know what I'm saying? Lord of Sirius. But you ain't ready for that. But uh, you know what I'm saying? You start learning. Then once you start learning, you get a certain amount of knowledge. Then you start passing on the knowledge to other people. Because when you have knowledge, you know. And when you know something, it's knowledge. The word of knowledge is not real talk. You see what I'm saying? So it's like, that's how it goes. Like, that's why I say, say these people don't give a fuck about your they'll walk with God, they don't give a fuck, so if you don't know what you're doing, and you trying to, you know what I'm saying, preach the word about this and this, you're only going to hurt yourself, because you're playing with forces you don't know nothing about, you know what I'm saying, like, come on, man, that's just like, that's just like you walking into a satanic church, and saying, the universe, you know what I'm saying, even though they believe in the universe, because you do have the dark lords, you see what I'm saying, like, the dark lords, they have spiritual power, they follow angels, though, you see what I'm saying, so they do believe in the universe, so let me give a better example, like, if you go in a, talking to a Christian BS, like, Jesus this, Jesus that, Jesus was a black man, by the way, uh, Jesus this, Jesus that, they're gonna fucking skin you alive, you see what I'm saying, because they don't give a fuck about your spiritual walk with God, they don't, you know what I'm saying, so wake the damn up, remember, man, first you have to, like, if you're going to do spirituality and you want to actually, like, you know what I'm saying, get into a spirituality and know yourself and get in tune with yourself, you got to know what you're getting yourself into because everybody's not built for this type of stuff. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Real talk. So wake the damn up. There's a fucking airplane. And away we go.